to um, this video series we'll be looking at survey one two three my name is Tessini Dumbo so um, in this video series we'll be looking at um, introduction to survey one two three and then in the next video we'll be looking at uh, web forms how do you get to prepare your survey uh, forms next we'll be looking at how you can share your survey data and then we'll be also looking at um, analyzing your survey responses we we'll would also go further to be able to see how we can manage um, data that has been collected via the survey form. Then lastly, we'll be able to see how we can report from our survey responses. That is to say, how can you create um, reports? All right, so a quick dive in, what is survey one, two, three? And so survey one, two, three is more or less of um, a form, which is a solution for creating, sharing, and analyzing surveys. And so when you find yourself in the field, um, this eliminates um, a process whereby you collect data using um, papers. And so the survey one, two, three creates smart forms uh, with little or no logic, which helps in supporting uh, a process in collecting your data in different languages. And so with Survey 123, you can easily collect data via web or mobile devices. And as well as uh, even when you are disconnected from the internet, you can as well collect sufficient data. And whenever you find yourself in an environment where there is network or internet, you can easily upload that data securely for further analysis. And so anywhere you find yourself at any time, you can easily what, capture this data and as well as um, works very well with your smart devices, laptops, desktops, or any devices that is an Android or an internet access based um, application or device. <clears throat> uh, with the use of Survey 123, you can actually design surveys that are that enable rapid collection with predefined questions that use logic to provide what's easy to fill answers. And these answers could be embedded into audio or video images and also offer many languages. It also supports the use of Excel form specification. Now, how flexible is this? Now, looking at different scenarios, the survey one, two, three is very, very flexible and allows you to easily what, create survey rapidly to start collecting data wherever you find yourself. Now, the totality of the survey is built on the ArcGIS platform. So using this, it helps you integrate all your data sets into a GIS platform, just as ArcGIS. The web form. So an example is how we see or create where we create our form. Uh, we have the blank survey whereby you can, on your own, design a survey that fits your purpose. And then we also have the template survey whereby you can use your template to create your designs. We also have um, the survey 123 Connect, which uses the Excel format whereby you can configure your survey from the use of Excel sheet. Now, this is an overview of the sharing platform. So this is where you can actually share your survey so that people can have access to it and fill it. As you can see, under the Collaborate tab, you can be able to share the link 
or you can use a barcode whereby you can be able to have access. And also it also have an option of who to share with everyone, members of the organization, or a particular group of people that are going into the field. Now, the survey 123 also has a tab whereby you can analyze the responses that you have received. Now, this is enabled where you have the analyze tab. As you can see from this tab, you would be able to analyze data in different formats, either in the use of pie chart, bar chart, graphs, and all the rest. So you can access that via the analyze tab. We also have the data management view. So the data management view gives you an overview of the location in which each data has been taken and as well as the list or information that has been collected by um, field workers that have gone to the field. Now, um, reports from survey responses. Okay, so the survey one, two, three has the capability to produce reports and these reports can be exported or can be saved in forms of Microsoft Word or in PDF formats. Okay, so at this point, we come to the end of the introduction to survey one, two, three. Thank you.